and welcome back from another shave El Shingon. Hope everyone's doing great. Good morning, Tuesday morning. Let's get the shave started. Sterling Soap Company, Autumn Glory. This is a faucet. Very nice strength, sand strength from the soap. I said about seven, mid strong. Very nice scent, spicy scent. Adam Glory is a difficult aroma to put into words. Imagine walking through the damp woods on a brisk fall morning with the leaves in the all autumn glory. This is, this is what this smells like. Like I said, spicy, spicy scent. Very nice smelling. Just got out of the shower, so my uh, skin is nice, hydrated, ready to go for the shave. Thank you for joining me once again. Appreciate all the subscriptions. Thank you. That's why I keep doing this for you guys. Some pre-shave. Prasso with menthol, eucalyptus oil. And menthol. Gift from my friend, Joseph Salazar. Thank you, bro. All the other stuff has great menthol in it. Very nice menthol. Hope everyone's doing well. Happy, happy shaves. I'm blessed to be here. Thank God. I thank God I'm in. All right, guys. I got my uh, brush here soaking. My Chicago share mug as always. I'm going to be using my chubby Frank shaving uh, brush and this has a 28 millimeter um, maggard two band 28 millimeter two band badger real thick knot the density of this, of this knot is unbelievable it is pa it's packed with hairs in there yeah that's what I'm going to be using today Autumn Glory once again. It's a sample, so I have it pressed in here. It's a one ounce sample. Real nice refreshing feeling from the menthol. Here we go guys. Start the loading. Stirring soap, as you know, it's great soap. As it says on their on their labels, premium soap, premium quality. I mean, which is true, very true. The low label that I showed you, it's a uh, older label from Sterling. That's their older label. Loading heavy here. So this is a big knot. It's a very big knot. I have to always load heavy whenever I use this knot. Here we go guys. The 
does not hold a lot of water too. The only thing I don't like about this brush is it's very slippery. So I gotta be careful not to get any uh, soap on the handle because it'll, it'll slip. I, have it, I had a chance I almost slipped and I caught it, which was good. But yeah, that's the only thing that I have on this uh, handle here. Can't get it wet because it's real slippery. The material, it's just very, I don't know, it's slippery. Other than that, it's a great brush. I had a synthetic on there when I bought it and I did not like the synthetic, it was too hard. The bristles were just too, it felt like a porcupine needle poking at your skin. So I had this restored by J.R. Reyes, he was the one that restored this brush. Got a nice lather on the face. It's caked with lather, guys. Creamy goodness from Sterling Soap. Sirens early in the morning, that happens all day here. I live downtown, so you always get that. It's annoying, but oh well, it is what it is. That's the benefit of living downtown, all the noise. Loading my blade, I'm gonna be using my Razor Rock Virgin One Hawk, single edge razor. Loading the blade and the razor. I love Prasso. Very great feeling on the face. That thing is like ultra ma ma mentalized to my to my in my opinion. You get a nice menthol from it. Cheers guys. The razor I'm going to be using today, my Hawk from Razor Rock, aluminum. Let's go guys with the shade. Pass one with the grain. Do for a haircut very bad. I'm gonna get one this weekend. Real thick soap from Zern Soap Company. Very slick as well. I'll cut myself. This is an aggressive razor. A 
efficient but aggressive. That's one complete. No menthol. Love it. Great pass. Now be careful. I'm gonna try the brush already. Slip, don't want it to slip. Here we go, guys. Pass two with the brush. Pass two guys against the grain. Forgot to mention two days growth on my face. You feel the blade, you can feel it with this razor. I feel it a lot. Which is not a bad thing, it's just aggressive. Now be careful. Like I said, it gives efficient shapes. And as always, that's in my opinion. Residual slickness, as always, with Sterling too. Oh. Nice shave.
very smooth guys that's a BBS shave right there touch up right there on my left hand side under my cheek and my neck Great shave, guys. You can still feel the menthol from the pre-shave, which is always nice. Always, whenever I use that pre-shave, the menthol sticks around through the whole shave. Yeah. Beautiful shave today. Thank you for joining me. Oh, yeah, that's smooth. One weeper right here, but it closed up already. Well, there in that, Chingon shave. <laughs> to recap, guys, I used today Sterling Soap Company Autumn Glory, which is a uh, spicy scent. That's what I get to my nose, spicy. The the description online. Uh, this is available right now on SterlingSoapCompany.com. Um, there's no scent description on there. All it says is what I read to you guys in the beginning of the video. So I have no clue what scent notes are in here. But yeah, check it out if you're interested. My Frank shaving brush, chubby. With the 28 millimeter magnet in there, on there. Real nice, uh, not great brush. Restored by Reyes at Reyes Restorations. Um, my Hawk version one, single edge razor with the feather artisan blade on there. Aggressive razor, but it gave me baby shape, BBS shape. Real smooth today. And to top it off, let me get some witch hazel. Hold on, guys. Witch hazel. Pre shave, I mean, post shave. Theirs is always nice. Feels great on the skin. Theirs with aloe. Theirs with aloe. And to top it off, I'm gonna be using Grisha League Square. Hope I said that correctly. And if not, I'm sorry. This is Chatillion Lux Aftershave in their older bottle. And uh Smells great, guys. It's a great scent. The scent notes are tobacco, leather, rose, clove, nutmeg, sandalwood, vetiver, musk, bergamot, and amber. A little bit of this stuff goes a long way. Cheers. No, I forgot. Hold on. Hold on. I gotta tap my face just slightly because this stuff works best when your face is wet. Okay. Oh yeah, beautiful scent. Ooh, I love Grisha Legs Luke Square. Grisha Leg Square. Awesome scent. <sighs> Chatillion Lux are luxury aftershaves to me. That's in my opinion. They last on my skin. The scent wise. Pretty much all day. I'll say half a day. But the ingredients in the aftershaves is what this aftershave shines. 
very moisturizing, great feeling, skin and food and aftershave. Oh yeah. Alright guys, take care. God bless you guys. Have a blessed day and see you next time. El Chingon says, yeah, take care. See ya.